Bricks, stones, cement, glass, water, energy. These resources together make a building. And we know every resource is running scarce. We are already pushing the limits of sustainability. And millions of buildings of modern India are yet to be built. They need to be built. So, are there alternatives? Can buildings of the future be different? Welcome to Venu Kutir. Set up in the India Habitat Centre, a comfortable living space put up in eight days. With prefabrication work of eight days, this cottage shows the potential of what could be the most sustainable and stunning building material of tomorrow. Bamboo. Bamboo is hollow from within, but otherwise a strong material. Its tensile strength can match that of steel and its specific strength matches that of concrete. Construction involves a lot of concrete and steel and producing these two elements releases a lot of GHG emissions. On the contrary, bamboo sequesters carbon and is environmentally friendly. It's one of the most easily and cheapest structural material that can be made available for construction purposes. Clearly, from the climate goal perspectives, bamboo is a material that should be promoted. Bamboo structures require a separate method of design as compared to steel and concrete. And here is how this one works. So this is a bamboo structure where the entire structure is used from staple bamboo. The framework is made from bamboo on which the roofing is fixed. The roofing is made from bamboo shingles, which is pasted on wood polymer composite, typically called as WPC, which is also a green material. The walls are made from flattened bamboo on the exterior face, as you can see here. And the inner face is made from bamboo mat. And both are fixed on WPC sheets on the bamboo framework. So the entire column beams, the purlins, the entire load transfer happens through bamboo. The flooring is stand woven flooring. It's also a bamboo uh, material completely. The fixation is done, is designed and done using bamboo pegs. Because if you put nails, the bamboo will split open as the fibers are vertical. So that's what the entire structure is all about. Be it a cold place, a hot region or a high wind area, bamboo is suitable for all climatic conditions. What we are trying to demonstrate here through this bamboo structure is that a good quality, structurally sound, aesthetically beautiful bamboo structure can be built where the lines, levels, a good modern looking structure is possible, which is what is suitable for the urban population. That is what they look at, a good contemporary design structure. Countries like Indonesia, Vietnam are leading in bamboo architecture and so could India. There is every reason to believe why bamboo will become one of the most important building material in a country like India. But we need concerted efforts in this direction. Reducing costs of construction to come at par with steel and concrete buildings and developing a large base of skilled manpower will help in wider acceptance of bamboo among builders and architects and position it as an affordable housing solution.